Hello internet, so today I'm going to show you how to remote control this garage door so it would work with different garage door. I have the Promatic 3 door in my case. So I'm going to use a steady 1 mini Gen 3. Uh, follow along if you want to see how I install it, but just to show you, I can press this button here and I have an alarm because I set up a door windows steady center. That is up to you if you want to add this. You don't have to, but I think it's nice to. I give you the link in the description if you want to. and. By the way, you click once, nothing happens, you click twice, then you do an action. So either open the door, or stop, or close. I do have this weird tree uh, sound and flashing at the end of each action. I'm not sure why. If everybody you know, please leave a comment. But otherwise, it's pretty good to have this remote control. It works very fine. So I'm going to connect this. We have the brown and the blue cable. The blue is neutral, at least is in my area, and the brown is alive. So just going to go next neutral there. And it's very dangerous. I mean, it's electricity. So if you don't feel comfortable, do call an electrician or at least call someone who know what he's doing because you could technically go to hospital or die is, I mean, is electricity. So I did cut the, the breaker, circuit breaker for the garage door, but don't mess around with electricity. Anyway, connecting now the live and then I'm going to connect two other cables to control the garage door. So that just plug to a normal um, plug, basically. Um, I could connect it directly to the motor, to 220 volt, but I just connect it like this for now. And we have these two other cable. I use a blue and brown cable, it doesn't matter too much. At least it doesn't matter for me because I know what I did. And then I'm connect, gonna connect this to terminal 20 and 21. I think is uh, 20 and 21. You might have to check the manual and your garage door might be different either way. So double check all of this. And now you can see the garage door. So you have the red and black connection on top. It's very horrible filming, I'm sorry. Um, but it's connected air through a normal plug, as I said, you can connect it directly to the garage door. That's what I did though. Uh, that's the plug itself, which is coming back to the Shelly. And you have then the Shelly air, which have all the connections. So the live and the neutral and the connection to the terminal and that's it for this video already it is very simple is nice present uh, christmas present i guess i see you soon in the next video see ya